nice nook chum nook shallow. Oh my god. Oh my god. Nice nook. No, no, no. Oh, he came out, he came out. Hey, yo, what is up, my Pescadorians? Thank you guys for tuning in to another video of mine. I really do appreciate it. So, in today's video, we're going to be hitting up some mangroves. That's mainly the only area we're going to be working around. And I'm going to be rocking the good old NLBN 5-inch K-tail. Let me see. You guys see that? Look how saucy that thing looks. Whoo! And we're just going to see if we can get on some big old snook today. That's a mission for today. And we're going to be on, we're going to be on the yak, so we're going to see if we can... Um, cruise around the mangroves and skip up under them or around them and see if maybe that's where we're gonna find the snook but i don't want to do too much talking thank you guys for tuning into another video of mine and let's get to it also i'm using the good old ford efficient product osprey ce pro 4k on the fenwick uh what is it elite tech and we're gonna see if we can get on some giants but like i said i just want to let you guys know what i'm throwing what setup i'm using so i don't want to do too much talking let's get to it Ew. Alrighty, my Pescadorians. So, we arrived at our spot. And before we start kayaking, we're gonna do some foot mission really quick off this ledge and see if we can find some snook willing to eat the K-tail. We're just gonna throw it out there. Let's see if there's something. There might be something right here. Oh my gosh, I had a hit. See, hopefully it wasn't a barracuda. It was a barracuda. Dang. Don't want to hook any barracudas today. This is my last big 5-inch K-tail. The other ones are, I think, the 4-inchers. Yeah, I, I figured it was a cuda just because I know I've seen kudas out here. And he didn't get hooked, so I'm like, it has to be a cuda. Let's cast all the way out there. As far as we can get out there. Just slowly retrieve it. Ooh, something right there. We just heard like a, a whale come out of the water right here. We're gonna see if it's still around. Enormous bait, enormous bait, Enor enormous fish. I'm hoping it's still around. What is that? Is that a snook? Yep, that's a snook. Up all the way up shallow on the K-tail, dude. So sick. Oh. No, 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 no. There he goes. Right through my feet. There he goes. Oh. I was so stoked on that and <laughs> he just came off right there. Just came off. Maybe I didn't get the hook right in them. I don't think that was a fish that blew up though. But that was sick. Right up shallow, guys. Super shallow, guys. Like super, super shallow. Oh, we know that color's gonna work. We haven't even hopped on the yak yet. Cause I heard something blowing up out here. I wish I got a better look at that snook, but it's probably like roughly like 25, 26 inches. Oh um, man, it was sick though, the way it blew up on it. Oh, really up shallow, like up in here, guys. <laughs> and I was just working on top and he smoked. I was just like twitching it, like doing this with the reel. And he smoked it right there on the surface. Let's do a couple more casts. Because there was a big one blowing up in here. So that's why I hopped out of the yak. I was like, yo, there's a giant up in here. But he hasn't blown up on the k-tail just yet but he did blow up like on the oh, i'm pretty sure like a big old molar or something because dude he came up sh he came up shallow it's a good fish except i just don't know what it was could have been a big jack or a nice nook well that was exciting um could have had a snook right there but he came off that i mean that's fishing can't get them all i might have to retie because I'm frayed it, yep. I'm gonna retie because I do not want to risk fraying up, so I'll get back to you guys once I do that. You nice nook chilling up shallow. 
Oh my god. Oh my god. Nice nook. Nice nook. Yo, that was so sick. He was chilling up shallow. Yo, 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 yo. That's so sick, guys. I just seen him chilling up shallow. I don't have a net. Oh my gosh, he took off so fast. Yo, that was probably one of my favorite eats I've gotten this year. And this year just started. Oh my gosh. Yo. Take him up shallow, take him up shallow. Perfect hook set. Dude, probably like a 25, 26 inch snook. But dude, I'm gonna get a quick video. <sighs> Clap the K-tail, guys. I, I hope the GoPro caught everything, dude. That was such a sick eat. He got spooked because I just launched a kayak. I seen him cast it and he guys probably one of my favorite eats of all time oh yeah she's coming down oh she's mad She's like, I've been caught, so I'm gonna have to clamp down. Beautiful snook. 26 inches. I'll take that. We'll move her side to side. Get some flowage going through her gills. Big back for a 26 inch, you guys. She's about to leave. I don't want to put too much pressure on her, but there she goes. I don't know if you guys can see. Open. <sighs> guys, that was so awesome. I really hope you guys saw that. So sick, I'm really frothing on that. We're gonna have to um, tie up a retie because she freighted us pretty good. So we're gonna get back to it and see if we get more fish. Ew. I'm just so stoked on that eat. I really hope the GoPro caught it. I just turned around, I'm like, there's a snook that I just launched off, and the snook was right there. The thing took off already, and that thing was on the five inch K tail, guys. And OBN is gonna kill it with this bait this year. And they still got the shrimp coming out too. Alright guys, we're gonna get back after it again. Now this time we're on the yacht. And we're gonna see if we can make some more of that snook action happen again. Super frothing on that. Now I'm just gonna do some paddle real quick. And then we're gonna get back out there. Yoo! So yeah, we're gonna work this whole mango vine and see how well we can do with the K-tail. See if we get on some more snook. I think maybe once we go on the other side, we'll probably be able to sight cast some fish. Log right there. Maybe there's some stuff in the shadow line. Let's check it out. Oh yeah, these mangroves are looking pretty darn juicy today. I mean, if we can get that K-tail up in there, and then there's some fish right there working down the mangrove lines. Oof gonna be easy money oh. oh my gosh oh my gosh should still be around oh dude that was awesome guys that was a nice nook I don't know if he'll eat again nah he didn't he won't eat again he knows. Now he knows. Let us sink. See if something's right there. Got him. Oh, he spat the hook. Little snook. <laughs> spat the hook right there. Another one. Yo, that's so sick. Oh, he came out, he came out. Another one back to back. That was so sick. On the K-tail, baby. <laughs> oh, oh, don't, 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 oh. Trying to get me up in the mangroves. That's good that he gets out there. Oh, no, 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 no. Look at that, hooked perfectly in the corner. Wow, 
But actually, no. Is it on top? Is it on the corner? Might be. Oh, oh, he's barely hooked, I think. Oh, no. Got him right on the top. That's where I got him. Look at that. All right. On the K-tail, guys. I'll give it like a solid 24-inch snook. Smoked it. <laughs> All right, we're gonna let him go. Beautiful snook. He's mad. So we're gonna let him go. I know. I'm trying to let you go. Oh, he clamped down. Yeah, you did not like that. That I caught you. Oh, no, no, no. Better release. Let me see. Look at that snook. We're gonna... Make sure he swims off strong. Alright, maybe he just wants to chill on the yak with El Pescador. Oh, there he goes. To the bottom. Oh, the dang K-tail. That's what I'm talking about, dude. Whew. Alright, we got some fridge. So we gotta retie real quick and get back out there. Dude, I'm telling you, the K-tail is the move, guys. It's an, it's gonna be a great bait this year, like, especially during summertime. I mean, springtime is perfect too, but summertime's gonna, the weather's gonna be a bit warmer, and not a bit warmer, actually, it's gonna be a lot warmer than now, and I'm hoping it's gonna have some of these snook super fired up. So we're gonna, we can give it a little toss back in there, see if maybe there's another snook in there. I like the K-tail because you can like cast up in there, let it sink, and that the fish will get a good look at it, and then you can start twitching it towards the top, and then they'll be like, oh, I want that. And that's what I did on the, se on the second cast of that snook. Alrighty. I think that's it for today. Maybe I'll fish on my way back, but for now, I'm going to call it right here. Um... That those that last one was last one and that was it. And it's getting windy and I think I want to get out real quick so I can lose all day today. Really blessed today to get out here, so thank you. Um, so I'm gonna get out get out of here, hop in the act, and we're gonna get see if we can get to moving. Alrighty my pescadorians. So that is it for today's video. Um we had a great day out in the water. And then that wind picked up, and when it picked up, it kind of turned off the bite, and they weren't really biting as they were earlier this morning. And also, with those barracudas, um, slowly pecking at the um, the tail, and it finally got the tail, and well, the tail came completely off. I don't know if you guys can see that, but yeah, the tail was off, so we were like, you know what, we're just going to call it for the day. And like I said, I got to go run errands, but I do appreciate you guys watching. I, I like really do appreciate it. And... That is it for the video. Really stoked on today's day. Beautiful day. So if anything, get out there, go fish, get tight, and crush some giants. Yeah.